Welcome to Melis Fairy. Today we're playing some more Tears of the Kingdom. And on the last video, we went to the castle and we fought a bunch of stuff. Basically, we fought like five or six herds of enemies, including ten Phantom Ganons, all to, in the end, uh, be rescued by the champions. And now we've talked to Pura and the champions. Well, I'm saying champions, the sages. I'm sorry, the sages. And we have to find the fifth sage, the sage of time, technically. So here it is, find the fifth sage. And our only lead is that we need to investigate the ruins. So I think, I'm pretty sure, that we're gonna have to go back to Kakariko Village and explore those ring ruins right here, because we couldn't really get into those, but I feel like now we will be able to. So we're gonna head over there and see what happens. Okay, we're gonna resume the research. Have you since figured out what became of Princess Zelda? Yes, yes I have. Oh. It's clear that the interior of this ring ruin is hollow. Sadly, there doesn't seem to be an entrance. If the contents of the other ring ruins are any indication, there should be a stone slab inside engraved with Zonai's script. First, we should look for a way to confirm that there's a stone slab inside. However, we also don't want to damage these Prussian ruins. Um, maybe I can ascend into it? Okay, maybe if I ascend here then. I think this is the highest spot. Okay, we're in. We're inside. How should I take a picture? Yes, I should. Okay. I was gonna say I'm not gonna be able to read whatever is happening here. Hello. Yeah, image. Look at my picture. So my inscriptions. Promise Zelda solemnly signed Mineru Sage of Hide the Key Southeast and Trust Future Wish Defeat Demon King. That's all I can make out. Okay, so it's a message from uh, Rauru's sister. So where? Mm -hmm. There's a site in Farron that has long been known as the Zonai Ruins. Yeah, I know. I know the place. Something related must be waiting. Okay, I, ca I can go there. Uh... I can go there. Or are you going there? Am I going? Mm. Is everyone going? There's a base in the Pueblo foothills at this kind of tower by the ruins. Okay. It is thundering. Oh, hold on a second. I have my my lightning helm if you want to see how I got this I have a whole video on just how to get the lightning helm it's not part of the normal playthrough but I did like a little side video it's on my uh, tears of the kingdom others playlist oh, there he is mm. it's a sonai mirror complete with intact text the style is unmistakable it's nothing short of miraculous that it's still here and basically intact. Wear the electric garb hidden at long-necked dragons along the wide-mouthed forest serpent. It calls to mind the tall pillars found around these ruins, designed to look like dragons. Forest serpent, though, I haven't seen any designs like that. Wide-mouthed forest ser serpent. Um, mm. Offer a zonite charge to the altar at the tail. Okay. I have Zonai charges. Oh. Okay, there's a chest. Oh. I can I can open chests. Charged shirt. Used in ancient rituals and made from conductive material, this item produces electricity during thunderstorms. Cool. Let's wear it. 
Oh, that's such a cool, such a cool outfit. Okay. I'm, I'm wearing it. It's just in the chest. In the chest. Yeah. There are other treasure chests containing the rest of the garments. Robbie was talking about creating some way that would make searching for things simple, though. Oh, I have the... Yeah, I have the sensor plus. Yeah, I can... I can... I can do that. I can take a picture of the chest. And then I can censor it. Sensor plus it. There. Okay, so now, how are we gonna do this, really? Because... Where the electric garb hidden at long neck dragons along the wide mouthed forest serpent. Okay, so it's gonna be around the lake. Like this is the open mouth. So I just have to find the pillars here, I would presume. Oh, there's all the Zalfos here. Hold on. Here it is. Okay, the pillars are all gonna have the same entrance. That makes it easier, you know, Bo? Okay, come here. This way. Trousers. Beautiful. Beautiful stuff. Okay, let's keep looking. There's one more. Oh, why would you blow your horn? I'm just minding my own business. Here it is. Cool. This is such a cool look. So my weather attack is up wearing all of these, which is pretty cool. Um, where am I going now though? Like, do I go back to talk to him? The wear the electric garb part of the code, yeah. Mm. Oh right, I have to find the the altar at the tail. Okay, so it's probably gonna be like here at the end. Okay, we're almost there. Okay, I'm just gonna put a charge here and see what happens. There we go. This is so cool. Nice clear. Oh, the sky islands that were revealed are new. Okay, I suppose yeah, because they were caught in the in that whirlwind of thunder. Um. So do I just go up there then? I can try. Like right above me. Let's see. Thunderhead Isles. There's still a bit of a climb here. I could probably use my balloon though. I think we're good. Height wise. Yeah. Okay, so, 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 so. I'm slightly confused. Oh, it's below me. It's below me. Dragonhead Island. And there's a, a shrine here. Mm. 
do we want to do the shrine? Let's just have it as a warp point right now. What what are we doing though? Like, what are we doing exactly? It's very pretty here. Oh, hold on a second. What what just happened? Is the, uh, you know what I was talking about? How I did the. Um, Thunderhelm quest. I also got this ability called Earthwake and I haven't actually used it, but I bet that's what's happening. It's a move that involves executing a charge attack with no weapons, so I can do that now. I just forgot that that was a thing. Okay, anyway. Okay. There's a door. Oh, hold on a second. This is like the um, the Temple of Time door where I needed four hearts. I'm not fully healed here. And I don't have food. I mean, I have some food, but it's not a lot. I don't know how many hearts I'm going to need here. But I want to be as healed as possible. I just, hopefully I have enough. Okay, everything's fine. That was almost all of them though, so I'm glad I healed a little bit. Excuse me. What is that? happening Link Zelda's chosen protector Hi Take this Follow the light Okay, I completed the Ring Ruins quest, but Guidance from Ages Past I'm sorry, am I supposed to pick this up or not? Because if I'm supposed to follow the light, then Shirley has to stay here. Am I wrong in thinking that? D do you know what I mean? Like, how am I supposed to, unless I pin it? Like if I pin the location and I take the mask with me somehow on earth am I gonna be able to take this mask with me though oh there's a thing here there's a thing here okay it's it's all making sense now okay we're flying we're flying Okay, okay, let's go down. Let's go down. Let's go down. 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 Okay, everything's fine. Then we get the mask from here. And. Um, how do I. Oh, there it is. Okay, that was that was a journey.
Tropio's Hollow Chasm. Oh, are we going underground then? I don't want to go underground. I really don't. We're going underground. Mmm, I don't like it. I don't like it. Link. Yes. Zelda's chosen protector. That's me. You must hurry. We must meet as soon as I'm possible. I'm coming. Exactly. <gasps> Construct factory. I remember this from the trailer. I remember that thing from the trailer. It was like coming out of the wall. Uh, should I? Should I? There you go. Is that not the thing from the trailer? Link, Zelda's chosen protector. My name is Minoru. I am Minoru. the Sage of Spirit. I am happy you have arrived. Thank you. At last, we can speak with you. Yes. It's... Unfortunately, I no longer have a I'm body. I'm sorry. Without a physical form, we cannot yet speak face to face. But, do you see the four storehouses in the area? Four storehouse. I'm gonna have to walk around the depths. <sighs> I would ask you to visit each of them and assemble a body. For I don't want to. This is my request to you, Link. Loyal swordsman to Zelda. Okay, at least I think it's the same thing from the trailers, like coming out of the structure. But it needs legs and arms, apparently. And ugh, okay, okay. How are we gonna do this? I have no healing food, <laughs> whatsoever. Um. Well, we can mark them. That's one, two. Where's the fourth one? Is it that thing over there? I don't even remember. Hold on, let's... I've marked that one. I've marked this one. Let's do this real quick. Which helps. One there. I think that's one, but it's very it's very far, so I'm not sure. I suppose we should start with this one. Left leg depot. <laughs> that's funny. I don't know why that's funny to me, but it is. Oh? 
I'm sorry, why? Okay. Surely you could have just let me through the door, but... this oh, it's like a bridge and there's another piece of it here that I cannot grab maybe oh I think I think I get it Put rockets on this thing. I might be able to get it to the other side. Possibly. Almost. Almost. So a little higher. Yeah, and then if I just ascend here. Then we should be able to do it. Yes, there is an enemy camp here, and yes, I'm gonna ignore it. Completely. Here's your leg. There we go. That's one. Bring the other three here as well. I'm working on it. Okay, so I've made it. Um, hold on. I suppose I've made it up a little bit, so I suppose we can go to that one. It seems close ish. Left arm depot. Thank you. Of course. Hate this, by the way. Hate that we get locked in. Hate that we can't recall the door. Hate it. Um. What's this? Oh. There's a steering thing here. Hmm. I have a horrible feeling <laughs> that I'm gonna have to, like, Turn this into some sort of car thing. I don't know. <laughs> We're gonna have to try. Okay. 
Okay. Oh, hold on. I don't think I can fit through here. Okay, this actually fits like this. Oh, here. I can attach them here, probably. Hold on. Right? And then... Yay! Okay. What, what, what? These are similar to the... Um, the... first doors we saw. I'm doing this wrong. I don't know, I feel like this is... Oh, hold on. I can just, I can just open the door. I feel... <laughs> I, I can just grab it and open it. Hold on. I feel so silly now. It's like they have the chains and stuff, and it's like... If we just hold it up for, for a second there... Oh, and then... And then some recall... There. Done. Okay, so now we go back. How are we doing this? Oh lord. We're gonna have to do some sort of uh, fan thing. Okay. Here we go. And just hope for the best here. And that's another part. Do luck. Okay. Um. So we can do that one next, I suppose. However terrifying it is that I can't see anything. Just can't see anything. Like, what? Oh, Hold on. I, I think I can make it there with the balloon, but I have no idea how I'm gonna make my way back, like down here. Oh, should I try the... for the light route? It seems counterproductive to be going the other way, but I feel like having the light brute will help. Thank you. Thank you, that's definitely helpful. Because now... Well, it's just helpful. <laughs> I think. Right leg depot. Okay, oh, what? 
Okay, so if we do this... Um, and get one of the fans... It's, it, there's, it's, it's blocked. Does, does that do it? No, it doesn't. I'm just thinking to myself here that if I get this here and completely ignore the, the puzzle, right? Just put this here. And... If I do this, stay with me, please. And I do this, stay with me. And then I recall. Where is it? Here. Then I've skipped the puzzle that I don't like. So there, <laughs> it's here. So if I auto build um, this and then I add a steering stick to it, right? And then we do this. So just one arm left now. One more left, Link. The body for my spirit is nearly complete. Thank you. So we want to go to the purple one now. Okay, we can do this, it's just one more. There's something's happening here. Um, please don't fall. <laughs> Might as well just walk it. Um, I have a theory. Like, can I walk on this if I if I wear my my lightning helm? I'm just I'm just like it. It seems it seems like like maybe I can. Although, hold on. If I do this, right? And then this, and I just walk it. That seems fine to me. So thank you. And 
then oh there's there's a there's a boss gloom bokoblin down there and I hate it I mean technically can't I just drop this like won't it won't it just fall and go I mean, yeah, there's gloom damage, but I feel like it might be worth just getting the damage. You know, which I haven't gotten yet, so. I feel like if we wait long enough, we might be able to avoid the bokoblins. Okay, it's an issue. It is. It is an issue. I'm gonna save, and we're just gonna have to see what happens. <laughs> I'm gonna have to fight them. I'm not saying this was a good idea, but... I feel like there's no choice, really. Just no choice. I just have to I have to do it. It's just a big one now. Oh no, there's still one here. So rude. Okay, they're dead. Uh, I do have the slight issue um, of my my health, my hearts. But we're right by a, a route anyway, so it's fine. Thank you. Here's your arm. Excuse me. Here's your arm. Thank you. Okay. Okay. You're all put back together. Can I have whatever it is you're gonna give me, please? Very curious. Yeah, this is the scene from the trailer. For sure.
Thank you. Thank You're welcome. Now only one task remains. Oh, what? We must recover my secret stone. Oh, okay. Whereabouts is this? Oh, that's far. It should be located here. Please, Link. Let us go there together. Together? You're gonna follow me? The path will be very dangerous. Fortunately, this construct body you have built for me is hardly helpless. There is a platform nearby where we can explore its potential. Interesting. Now hurry, Link. We must recover my secret stone. I'm slightly confused as to... Oh, it's like a ride. Oh, this is so cool. This is the coolest thing. The weapon steer can draw for the true power of this construct. Attach one to a hand and your power in combat will be magnified severfold. The road to the secret stone is long and arduous. I recommend that you make stops at each armory along the way. Get accustomed to operating this construct so that you are prepared for whatever you may face. You can attach things to the hands or back of Minerva's construct. The attached objects can augment the construct's movement or combat abilities. Um... Uh, so this cool and then shock emitter flame emitter shock emitter to the left one okay oh that's not working at all that works, but the the shock emitter wasn't working. I'm dead. How am I dead? How is this the moment I die in this game? I was just walking and trying to test out some powers. Okay, she follows me around. So technically. 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 If I just run, is she follow she is, she is following me. So I don't have to use her right now. There's a light route here, so we should definitely go to it. Thank you. Oh, there's a Gloom Hinox over there. Yeah, we're just gonna avoid everything. Like, this is ridiculous. <laughs> okay, we've made it to another one. This construct cannot climb a sheer cliff face. The construct might be modified somehow in a way that enables access. Uh -huh. Sure. Uh, where are you? Minoru, here you are. Um, so if I do attach um, to the back, right? And then we do this. Hey! There you go. Spirit Temple. The vessel of spirits resting place. Okay, I kind of just did a whole temple thing though with, with the body parts. Is this going to be a separate thing with locks and stuff? Yep. It looks pretty. I just wonder like, am I going to do a whole... <sighs> Other temple thing? Okay. 
Okay, warp point. I suppose we're doing a tempo. Oh, that's the stone, that's the tear. <laughs> what are the chances of me just being able to grab it? It's, this is like a, an arena for a fight for sure. There we are. I made it long ago. You made it. But the glow. Nice going. Must be under the control of something monstrous. Seized construct. If the Demon King has turned my creation into his pawn, we must defeat okay. it. Okay. We can do this together. Can we though? Gets hardened up in the wires. Oh, I'm dead. How am I supposed to defend myself from that attack? That one. Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. I'm so annoyed right now. the devices in the room. That doesn't look good. It brought out more arms. Be careful. We won't last long at this rate. We need to find another approach. I can't. How am I supposed to? supposed to be doing here. Oh. So 
So it does go on the floor for a very limited amount of time. Okay. So if we just avoid the aerial attacks. Device, the construct dropped. What zone and device he dropped? Oh, I, I see. I still feel like my strategy is probably better. It has to stop moving to attack. Wait for that moment. Okay. Okay, one, one more. One more. If you just hit me once. Now. There you go. That was hard. <laughs> that was a hard fight. Maybe because I was so underprepared. It's done. Ooh, heart container. Amazing. Are we getting a memory? Thank you. It's pretty cool now that we just have this robot thing that we can just use. It definitely makes me want to upgrade my batteries a bit more though. Yeah. Are we gonna get another lesson about the imprisonment war? Zelda asked me to aid you, Link. I am the Sage of Spirit, and one of the Zonai. Minu. This is very exciting. I am glad to meet you, Link. I must thank you. It is because of you that we have recovered my secret stone. Originally, my intent was to awaken when you first found the Poripad, then to guide you to my construct and assist you on your journey. I had not anticipated a battle with that same Yeah, construct. I wasn't anticipating that either. You have proven quite adept, and I am grateful for all your efforts. It's okay. Link, here. In the name of Minoru, Sage of Spirit, I grant my power unto you. Thank you. I believe 
it will serve you well. With this power I've given, a deep bond has been forged between us. And from this point forward, my spirit will reside within that construct. I will help you however Thank I can. you. Very appreciated. I am one who lived in the distant past in the age of Hyros founding. Circumstances forced me to forsake my body and become a being of pure spirit. Long have I slumbered within Zelda's pure pet in order to share what I knew when it passed into your hands. I apologize that our meeting has been so long delayed. The Demon King's interference is to blame. Nevertheless, I ask your pardon. It's totally fine. I was doing other stuff too, so. Well then. In my own age, the distant past, from your perspective, Zelda awakened as the Sage of Time and appeared before us. What I must relate to you is a tragedy that occurred in Hyrule's history. At its crux was Zelda who held a secret stone and traversed time. She made a momentous decision in those days gone by. Yeah, I know. I know what happened. Long ago, my people, known as the Zonai, came down from the heavens to the surface of the world. It was said they were descendants of gods. They bore treasures from these same gods, secret stones capable of amplifying the abilities of those who possessed them. Using the knowledge of the Zonai, my younger brother Rahu became a great leader. He met a young woman named Sonia, and they would wed. Rahu gifted Sonia one of the secret stones. Together, they sought to establish their kingdom. This is how the kingdom of Hyrule, with Rauru and Sonia as its first king and queen, came to be. The future looked bright. And then... However, tragedy suddenly struck. A man of great evil emerged from the desert. The leader of the Gerudo... Ganondorf killed Queen Sonia and stole her secret yep. stone. Using the secret stone, Ganondorf transformed into the Demon King. He then created swarms of monsters and attacked. Hyrule rose up to face these threats, but the evil power driving the monsters forward was staggering. The defenders were on the brink of defeat. Rauru then came up with a plan to turn the tide of the war. He entrusted secret stones to warriors with exceptional abilities. They became the sages champions. and united in an effort to finally defeat the Demon King. Rauru and the sages outnumbered the Demon King and should have been able to stop him. However, the Demon King's power had grown far beyond anything we could have imagined. I was unable to withstand his strength. Our fight appeared all but lost. And then, Robert. What is he doing? He committed himself to one final act.
that's a punch. so smug. I know exactly what it will cost me. Oh. <laughs> I hate seeing Zelda upset. Thousands of years will pass on the blink of an eye. You will do the inevitable. So Raro is the one who... You're wrong. Years from now, someone will appear with the sword that seals the To the depths. A swordsman with the power to defeat you. Link. Remember. Remember this name. name. Explains why Raru's arm was there when we first came across Ganondorf in the beginning of the game, and how it was like given, like saved Link and was attached to Link's body and all. Amazing. You know this tragedy as the imprisoning war. Though it took all we were able to give, we succeeded in imp imprisoning the Demon King. But I was wounded in the process. My body was soon to expire. Whoa. That is when Zelda came to me, bearing a decayed and broken sword. You will recall how the Master Sword vanished from your hand at the Temple of Time. From there, it traveled into the distant past, appearing in Zelda's hands. And now you hold it once again. I do hold it. You're saying that sword traveled through time the same way you did? Yes, but more importantly, in my original time, the Demon King was vulnerable to even the smallest piece of this sword. Even someone like him has vulnerabilities. Hmm. Then, what exactly are you suggesting we do with the sword? Over time, the Master Sword is able to absorb sacred power. It can heal itself, and even grow stronger. Curious. If we were able to empower it in that way, it could be the key to defeating the Demon King. But it could take centuries for that sword to grow strong enough. The power the Demon King wields. I do not see how this can be done. It would be impossible for you to provide it with sacred power for so well, long. Well, she did it. I can think of one way. You mean? Yes, I can do it. I have to. I've told you, that act is forbidden. For a very good reason. It would mean throwing yourself away. <gasps> oh, Maru! You won't be able to change back. The moment I had the sword, I knew what to do. I knew this was why I came to the Zero. I want to restore the Master Sword and deliver it to Link. Even though I know what happened, this is still sad to watch. You really have made up your mind? <laughs> Very well then. As a Zonai, I bear my share of blame for these events. So I too will devote myself to this goal, and to this hero of yours. For the Swordsman Link, I will do everything I can. Even if my body should perish, I will still be with you in spirit. Oh, this game is gonna be the death of me, like emotionally. 
Yeah, yeah. Master Sword. I still have faith that Zelda's gonna well, go back to normal because Impa said she's working on it. And if there's one person I trust in this world, it's Impa. Battle of Minoru Sage of Spirit. Very cool. Complete. Trail of the Master Sword. Honey, I have the Master Sword. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> well, I suppose I have to tell Pura now that I've done all this. Yeah. I have the thing. Everything's done. What? Yeah. Yeah. Five stages. Yeah, Master Sword. You're prepared to face our enemy. Am I? Oh. We need to determine where the Demon King is lurking. It seems unlikely he'd still be in Hyrule Castle. I can't think of any place he'd be here on the surface. That must mean the huh? depths, of course. Of course. Of course he's in the depths. Yeah. yeah. Destroy Ganondorf. Oh, I, I just got chills. Let me talk to Joshua real quick. I mean, he's probably just under the castle. Like, just in the chasm, like, under the castle. Right? Oh, she's just talking about the statues and stuff. So yeah, that doesn't help me much. But, uh, yeah, I mean, it, he's, yeah. He's probably just, like, here. Like, right here. So yeah, technically, I'm ready for the end. But if there's anything that today has proven is that I am not prepared. I have no food, I'm very low on arrows, so I'm gonna have to do a lot of grinding. A lot of grinding before actually facing Ganondorf. So I'm not necessarily gonna do playthroughs of grinding, but every time something exciting happens, I'll, I will post a clip on it on the others playlist that I have here on the channel. And then once we're ready, we will do endgame. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time.